Changes are coming to the I-90 corridor in Post Falls beginning in 2023. The existing Interstate 90 and Idaho Highway 41 interchange will be replaced with a new interchange. Community input from two public open houses in 2018 and 2019 helped guide the redesign of the interchange. Concerns were shared regarding the safety of the existing westbound loop ramp and a few other aspects of the interchange. The current design eliminates the need for a loop ramp and addresses many other concerns heard at the open houses. The community strongly supports the need for this project and the new interchange design will improve safety, capacity and operations throughout. Construction will occur in several stages over multiple seasons. Two lanes of traffic will flow in each direction along I-90 throughout the project during peak travel hours. When construction is complete, the project will also improve bike and pedestrian access. The interchange type is known as an offset single point urban interchange or SPUI. Rather than a traditional diamond interchange with two sets of traffic signals for on and off ramps, a SPUI has one signal which controls all of the interchange traffic. Unlike a traditional interchange with four signal phases, the SPUI will have three phases which will increase efficiency. The Idaho Transportation Department would like to show you how this interchange will work so that you are familiar with it when it opens. Traffic will be controlled by a single signal located in the center of the interchange. This signal will control through movements on Highway 41, the traffic that is not turning, traffic leaving I-90 and turning left onto Highway 41, and traffic leaving Highway 41 and turning left onto I-90. Highway 41 will be relocated to cross under I-90, west of the current crossing location. A concrete curb will be added to divide northbound and southbound traffic from the new interchange to north of Mullen Avenue. Reinforcing existing access patterns, traffic leaving businesses within this stretch of Highway 41 will be unable to turn left across the divider, making this section of the corridor safer. Traveling from I-90 to Highway 41, drivers will exit via the ramps and either cross under I-90 or use the new ramp that replaces the existing loop ramp. Drivers traveling northbound on Highway 41 from Herborn to I-90 will either turn left onto I-90 westbound or right onto I-90 eastbound. Traveling from Celtis to I-90, drivers from both directions will have two lane choices, one for eastbound I-90 and another to travel west. Similarly, drivers traveling on Highway 41 from Mullen to I-90 will turn left onto I-90 eastbound or right onto I-90 westbound. Traffic along I-90 will continue to flow past the interchange as it does today. The new interchange design improves the safety and connectivity of existing bike and pedestrian corridors. Sidewalks will be added or restored throughout the project area. Bike lanes will be added on both sides of Ross Point, Celtis, and Mullen. This project will improve the intersection of the Highway 41 Trail and Centennial Trail, including a new pedestrian signal across Celtis. A new bike path will replace the existing Highway 41 bike path and provide access from the Central and Primrose intersection as well as the Mullen and 41 intersection to the south side of the interstate. A tunnel will be added for the bike path to cross under the eastbound on-ramp. A bridge will be added for the bike path to cross over the westbound off-ramp. 
A second tunnel will be added for the bike path to cross under Highway 41. The new SPUI will facilitate higher volumes of traffic safely and more efficiently than the existing interchange. Be sure to drive slowly and carefully when first navigating the new interchange in order to become familiar with it. Read overhead directional signs for assistance. The Idaho Transportation Department thanks you for your interest in this project and for taking the time to learn about it. To learn more, please click the link in the description below.